Now we're recording. Cool. Thank you. Yes, go. Cool. So I decided to go through with my light bulb project. So basically, I'm going to make a Google site because um, I don't really know how to make an actual website, but it seems pretty easy to make a Google site um, so people can like buy light LED bulbs in bulk, which are normally like really expensive, and that's why it's sort of like a lot of people don't get them, but they're cheaper if you buy them in bulk. So I was like going to make this website for people to like share with their friends or like their neighbors and stuff so they can buy them a lot of them together because like obviously as an individual you don't want to buy more than you need so why would you buy in bulk as an individual even if the price is better um so yeah um i so what i'm working on right now is figuring out or making the website but also like deciding like where to get the light bulbs from so i can like have sort of like a price standpoint because on my website I want like a calculator like of what what's going to cost like how many do you need or, and also like how many people are ordering it together because that will like change the pricing so I'm still sort of figuring that out and deciding whether I want like high quality I don't know I've been getting like really into like the nitty gritty of like researching light bulbs it's very interesting but uh so I don't know if I want like high quality light bulbs that are a little pricier or like average quality, but like really cheap. So yeah. That's interesting. I like that. I think, um, I think you can have like both on there. I, like if you have the time or like find both, I think it would be good to have both on there for like people on different sides of the spectrum. Yeah. That's um, a good idea. Yeah. Um, I like that idea. That's cool. Because I, I noticed, um, like, I know that LED light bulbs can be expensive, so I think it's a good idea to, like, buy in bulk and then share with people. I think that's interesting. Thanks. Yeah, and then I was also looking, because, so I live in Seattle, and a couple of years ago they did this program where you can, um, like, turn in your old light bulbs, and they would give you a free LED one for every old one that you turn in. Um, I think it was limited to, like, five, though. But... I was thinking, like, I could also put a section on my site of, like, how to recycle your old light bulbs, because that's another, like, eco-footprint thing. Yeah, that's cool. That's a good idea. That's very cool. Um, if I can add some, like, when you are building your, your Google site, um, if you need any help, I've been working on my Google site for the past three years, so I've been able to understand how to make pictures bigger or smaller. Like, it's very different from what you see in your pre-page to your published page. So if you have any questions, let me know, and hopefully I can help. That would be awesome, because I've never made a website before, <laughs> so I'm sure I'll have questions. Cool. Um, okay. And so I've jumped around on, like, a couple different ideas, but um, I landed on my... Like, for the past couple of years, I've been wanting to, like, get a compost bin at my house because my family eats a lot of, like, fruit and, um, like, things with peels that can easily be composted. Um, and, like, I hate throwing it in the trash or disposable. Um, but, like, our house is on the market, so we're hoping to move soon. So my dad's like, no, we can't get a compost bin. Um, but I've talked to multiple other people, like, at my school uh, or in my community who said, like, they want to get a compost bin at their house, too, but they don't really know how to do it. So I was going to make a website that um, is going to, like, explain, like, a basic how-to of composting, um, maybe give some, uh, like, links for, uh, like, quality compost bins or, like, compost bins that aren't super expensive but, like, still worth the buy. Um, and also like why it's good for the environment, what to do with the compost after like it's done fermenting. Um, and yeah, so I'm going to make that into a website and I'll use like Wix or something. I've used that before to make a website. So. Cool. I like that because I, so in Seattle we have like municipal compost. So like, just like our trash bin, we have a compost bin that gets picked up. So I just like throw it in a bin and I don't even like think about what happens to it. And so it's really cool that 
like you can sort of learn more about that process and like be a part of that and like use the compost after. Um, so like, even for me, even if I don't need a compost bin, I'd still be interested in learning like what happens or like where it goes, you know? Yeah. My school has that like pick up compost thing. I wanted to get it, but they don't come to my house. Got it. Yeah. Cool. Um, are there like pre-made compost bins? Cause I've heard of people who have made their own just like in their backyards, but is that something that you can buy now? Yeah, they have them on, like, Amazon and okay. eBay and stuff like that. Cool. Did not know that. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Abby, um, I was talking to Clara Medina um, this week, and she had a different idea for her Catalyst project last week, but because of COVID-19, she decided to change, and she's also doing composting. So um, I don't think I can ask, but I don't think you guys can work together but I, uh, uh, like, I mean, in the, like, you guys cannot do the same WordPress project, but, um, for the Callus conference, but I think you guys should talk to each other and see what is different or the same or similar in your cities, you okay. know, and then maybe share some ideas. I don't know, maybe. Okay. I'll do that. Yeah. Thank you. All right. Okay. Well, speaking of that, ladies, uh, I, I don't know. Is there, would you like to share more? <laughs> I don't want to step in before you guys are done. <laughs> Um, okay. No, we're good. Okay. Um, I'm gonna, can I share my screen? Hold on. Oh, do I have to give you permission? I think you need to give them permission, por favor. Uh, okay, let's see. Okay, I think you can share now. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Okay, cool. so I don't know if you got my, my message or not, but oh, I, because we're meeting, uh, I can show you now. Um, I did some changes to module 5.5 and it used to look just like this, like it didn't have any other information. And so this is what I did. I changed, um, I updated the page and I'm asking you guys if you can Zoom tomorrow, but if we are together right now, then you guys don't have to Zoom in with us tomorrow, unless you want to, of course you can. Um, so you guys can start working on your WordPress because all the Catalyst Conference projects will all be together in the WordPress. Um, and so if you guys want to get started, once we're done, then follow these steps. So you guys would click here and you will find, hold on. No. If you guys click here, you guys will see that you will find a username and password. So this will be your username. This will be your password. Okay. And then you take that username and password and then you click here. Okay, internet kind of slow. <laughs> and it will ask you for a username and password eventually. <laughs> okay. And then, este, and then once you do that, well, I, I'm gonna wait for this to open. Once you do that, then there's this tutorial that you don't need to like, you just need to click on this link and it will take you to a how to use WordPress. If you've never used it before, it's just, you know, it's like a five minute and a half minute video, but it really just takes you through the steps of um, how to use WordPress and then begin adding content, okay? Uh, you don't have to design from scratch. There are many templates and many ideas. The deadline to uploading all your information is April 18 by 10 p.m. And here are some more videos that you guys can check just in case, like, this is like, a presentation example of what it could look like okay and then this is like if in case you guys lose your password uh, what to do to make a new post to add a video to add a video from YouTube to add more text or to add media to a paragraph block okay so okay, let me see right okay so <laughs> let me click on this again see if it will open up now um, so anyways when my internet is working again, those are the steps that you guys need to take um, to start working on your WordPress. Now, if um, what are you, what do you guys have to include on your WordPress? If you guys go back to module 5.3, let me see. If you guys go here to 5.3. And you guys follow these steps um, 
or and also you have the final planning sheet to help you uh, that's what you guys need to basically just copy and copy and paste into your WordPress does that make sense yeah do you guys okay, so yeah tell me um, what are we copy and pasting into the WordPress okay. so make a doc, make a copy of this document and basically you guys have to add like this what is your your beautiful question is what are you talking about well, if you're talking about the light bulbs, then what about the light bulbs? If you're talking about composting, what specific side of composting or composting in general or composting in your particular city? Like, what about it? OK, what kind of impact does it have? Well, here's a little bit more on your community. You know, um, what is and then in your project response, it can be a model that is working in another community and you want to bring it in an original idea that you want to start in your community or something that you can implement in the future or in the near future, okay? If you have local resources, how, why, how did you come to this? Like, why are, how are you using those resources? Um, what are the sources that you guys found online? Like, you at least were saying that you were really finding, it, like, weird, not weird, but, like, new information about light bulbs and what that entails, you know? So, like, those are your sources. And then if you have essential media, Anything that you guys have from videos, charts, uh, photographs, um, articles, whatever you guys need, you also include there. So basically, you guys take all this information and you copy paste it. Hold on, let me see. Okay, there we go. This is what you guys will see. Okay, so you guys will use your your username is your first name, period, last name, and your password. Let me show you. Your pass password is GOA GOA eighteen. I think everybody has the same password. Like, and then it asks you guys to to change your your password. Hold on, let me just make sure. Oh, actually, I have it here. Sorry, no, I have it here. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, your password for every same password, but it's going to ask you guys to change your password um, once you log in for the first time. Does this make sense? Yes. Más o menos. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. So again, if you guys want to join us tomorrow to maybe see what other people, what other people, what other questions people have, um, then please join us. If you guys feel ready and gone ho to start on this, then go for it. And again, it's due on the, what did I say? On the 18th and that's it. Cool. All right. Okay. All right. Okay, I'm excited, ladies. Thank you so much. Uh, right now, in 15 minutes, I don't know if you guys saw the invitation I sent you guys to talk to Julia and Erin. Um, and they're like, they're right now up against the Supreme Court. Well, not the Supreme Court, not against the Supreme Court, but like the things that they're doing have gotten to a level where um, they're fighting for climate change and they're fighting for um, things that will affect all of us in the future. And so they were able to book us for a little bit of time. So if you guys can hop, hop in, that would be great. If you guys are busy, I understand. Um, so yeah, just wanted to invite you guys. Cool. Do you know how long it's going to last approximately? I have no clue. To be honest, okay, I have no clue. <laughs> I could come at like 4th or I guess 1130 UTC, like in 45 minutes. Sure. I can't hop okay, in, so yeah. I don't know. If is okay. it still going to be well, going? Well, click on the link, and if we're still there, then you can just join us. Okay. Okay. Well, okay. Yeah, I have another call right after this, so I can't go. That's okay. Unfortunately. All right. Well, thank you, ladies. This has been great, and I hope I was able to answer more questions instead of creating more questions. Huh. <laughs> um, so if you do have any other questions, you know where to find me. Great. Okay. All right, guys. Have a good day. Bye. Bye. Bye.